to another episode of Daring Fables. Yay! Yay! It's been so long. The day think- was real genuine. For me, is Ingrid sleeping? Ingrid. Ingrid. We my took too long. Ingrid Sarah. here. My name is Sarah Renee and I have a migraine. <laughs> Listen, I don't for once. I I'm in a bit of pressure and I should probably take Excedrin. You used your oh, twin no, powers it's... for evil. And now Two. I'm <laughs> near <laughs> dead and dying. And you sound like a dying robot because of the feedback. So well, uh, speaking of Excedrin and migraines, uh, CVS called me out. CVS sent me a coupon for 30% off in the, on the email. And we're like, you might like to use it on this. And it was a picture of Excedrin because that's what I buy there all the time. And then the next day, they said me, we're running a special on Excedrin. Sarah Renee, <laughs> you've bought a lot of Excedrin. You might be interested in our... You know, spend twenty dollars on Excedrin and get ten dollars extra cash back. And I was like, "You are not wrong." So last night I went and I spent like thirty dollars on Excedrin. Wow! But yeah. but you have a lot now. I have a lot now, and like I'm going to use it. The people have been waiting, and now they finally have their updates on Sarah's migraines. Uh, yeah. Because that's point, what this show is really yeah, about. At some point, I'm gonna go to a doctor and get on real medication. She sounds fake. To me the FDA just said now. proved a preventative medication, but like it's supposed to be really good. Mm-hmm. I don't know if I would immediately go on that, but so anyway, anyway. So um, Jules, Jules is not here. She's with um, Jesus now. <laughs> Jules is not dead. She's guys. not dead. She's perfectly fine. <laughs> Jules is not able to play anymore again. Um... Yeah. Chip so. decided just, not yep. to come yeah. with us. <clears throat> yeah. Um I mean I think Chip is still there, but like I don't know. It's weird for me to just like play Chip. So So Chip's just not I think what happened was Chip had a sudden revelation about his quest and he just went running away and we were all like, bye. <laughs> okay, <laughs> have fun. <laughs> So you guys are in the barn. We are. We're with doing some dogs, wish quiz. And you just did the wish quiz. Um, I like how you assume the wish quiz is over. <laughs> <laughs> okay, you, do, you are made I wish didn't. quiz. I said we're doing the wish quiz. Do you have more wish quiz questions? I don't know. Well, come back. Wish back. Does anyone have more wish quiz questions? I'm um, so tired. <laughs> this is going to be a weird episode where Ingrid is just dying. Holy well, shit. Well. Justin. I told you yesterday, Justin's moving yeah. to Washington. Well, he's moving to Washington. He's going to go work for fucking Wizards of the Coast. Oh my god, Justin, get me in. For what? Wizards of the Coast made Dungeons and Dragons. Oh. Topical. Tell him, Justin, we're playing Dungeons and Dragons right now. Does anyone have more wish quiz questions? I thought Dora would have more wish quiz questions. I did. But Dora's no. dying. Yeah. No, I'm dead. So. Oh, um, okay. We're going to decide if we're going to spend our wish now or later, I guess. I feel like we don't have enough of a... Of a thing to do with it now. Because mm. here's... Sarah and I were talking about this. Mara would use the wish to get her list of, of... Her hit list. Yeah. But I don't know if Ripley and Dora would be like... Maybe let's not give Mara a list of people she wants to murder. Um, I don't know. Um. I also don't know, like... If they wouldn't do something that's more them but also it's like Robin was like it'll take me a while to complete it and it was just kind of like oh so it's just us asking you to do a thing because apparently (laughs) you wouldn't do things for us anyway (laughs) you can't grant anything god I mean they can Robin is a useless genie it just depends on the thing okay they gotta use special magic we gotta be our selves now. Okay. You mean your characters. <laughs> yeah. 
You know what I mean. <laughs> you guys are in a barn. We're in a barn. We're in a barn. Okay, well, while you guys you are... Your s- camera's at the bottom. You just blocked it. Oh. Um, While you guys are standing around in the barn. Oh, no, Avery's going to show up. <laughs> no. Do we have to um, roll a little piece? A little piece of paper slides under the barn door. Okay. Oh, no. No, I don't Does want the someone fuck wanna... boy back. I don't want him, Shannon. I don't. Does someone want to pick Mara up Mara piece... picks up the paper and reads it. Okay. How does, does Mara know how to read? Yes, she does. She got the note from Badger. You're right. And she writes her letters to Lauren. Yeah. It would be really funny if she didn't know how to read. <laughs> She's just writing. She draws it all in comics. Like, she writes pictures. Emojis. <laughs> It's like Lauren, dear Lauren, but it's just like a picture of Lauren. <laughs> and it's then got like, like a hearts. pirate hat. <laughs> <laughs> and so this entire time that Mara's been like saying this is what's going on, she's just drawing elaborate pictures. Oh, Lauren has them all on. hung hung up. And like, it's funny, like Richard Quinn's notebook Lauren. is all in comic. So Lauren's <laughs> superb, you little funky bisexual. <laughs> <laughs> it just papers the walls of the inside of the ship. People come in to Lauren's like, room to be menaced, and there's these just these comics that are girls. It's like dogs. next to the like, gunpowder, and they're like, is it this a fire hazard? <laughs> that would be amazing. Um, anyway, it's a it's a piece but of no, paper. So Mara knows how to read, how to read guys. Okay. Uh, and <laughs> I'm glad we deliberated on that. And we reached a conclusion. <laughs> It's a it's messy <laughs> handwriting, and it just says, "Assassin, meet me at the fortune stage." Mara, I guess that's me. <laughs> Marty's like, read it could it, be me. She has read it out loud, and Mara's like, "I didn't think of that." Should we both go? Just like just in case. Also, because uh, because buddy system. Yeah, but who's I mean, the assassin? It doesn't um, say come alone. You're right. You're all, so y'all. right. What if all of us go and then we can make sure that nothing bad happens? Okay. And I like, like maybe know how we I feel get about being fight. right next to you. I know. I don't this like is clear. This. I don't like this. I'm okay. talking to Sarah. I'm, Guys, Liz, Shannon has we've, we've switched rearranged. the arrangement of the seating, and now I'm sitting right next to Sarah. It's weird. There's not laptops separating you. I'm just... Yeah, the, Sarah's the not, role play. Sarah's it's a weird angle for Bye. role playing. <clears throat> anyway, but continuing, um, I was going to be like, well, I can't talk to you and look at Shannon. Hi, I'm talking to Mara. <laughs> like, no. I know, it's, it's weird. We'll get used to it. It's weird now. Okay. Um, but you're not an assassin. And I wouldn't want but you it's a, or your sheep it's still to a, get hurt. It's still a festival. We could just be at the festival okay, and just be near the... I guess, with all the sheep, you just surround. And, and like, sheep. maybe if we all go, then we'll get in a fight and we can level up. <laughs> <laughs> all right. All right. Um, okay. Dora Wrong got cold. Wait, in shit, between. where did I leave Lucky? Is, no, is it Lucky Lucky's here? Lucky's with you. Lucky's here. <laughs> where did I leave you him? You made him face You the left wall. him in the other room with the dogs. That's right. He's in the other room with the dogs. That's right, yeah. He, he left the room to pet dogs. He's, like, in the house or you something. You also left the room to pet dogs, but I guess you came back. <laughs> I guess I came back. I don't know. Guys, is Robin still out? Matter. What's happening? Robin is always out. You it's Pride know. Month. <laughs> it's Pride Month. Robin is always out. Happy Pride Month, guys. Happy Pride Month. I am the I just want to quickly interject and say that um, recently in my journal, I saw that we started playing D&D a year ago. Wow. So it's been <coughs> over a year of this, and we still <coughs> haven't made it out of the <coughs> festival. Recently, I went to Goodwill and I to celebrate Pride Month, and I bought four flannel shirts. Because I like those now. <laughs> Very good. Okay, so uh, is everybody going to the fortune stage? Yeah, yeah. sounds yeah. like it. Is Do we put Robin hey. away, guys? Please. Uh, Robin goes away. I, I go over to Lucky, and I'm like, hey, Lucky, so we got this mysterious note asking, uh-huh. for, <laughs> asking for an assassin to meet them at the fortune stage, and we don't know if it's me or Marty, so do you want to come? 
It's apparently a uh, party. <laughs> sure, like, I guess if everybody's going. Or do you want to stay here and pet the dogs? Like, that's uh, also fine. I mean, that's a really hard decision. Uh, but, like, I don't know. It would be weird to just be here by myself. I'm just, I mean, you want to be here by yourself because the dogs are yeah, here. But Catherine's like, here. Catherine's cool. Yeah. Catherine's here. Yeah. And Chip will be here. <laughs> I just don't really know them very well. Because he knows you, so. <laughs> yeah, y'all met, like, twice, and now you're already... No, I mean, I'll come with. I, it's, yeah, I'll life. come with. I want to support know. you. <laughs> oh, my He's God. He's a good boy. <laughs> what a good boy. He's so nice. Um, that is Mara, like, saying that really soft. You're yeah. so sweet. Oh, thank you. You're so nice. Okay, you guys going. Yeah. Go into the fortune yeah, stage. Yeah, we're going. It's kind of moving this plot. It's kind of the middle of the night. Um, <laughs> Just a little by bit. The way, but uh, yeah, you go. Anything interesting <sighs> while you're going? Um, I'm on the lookout because I don't trust that Avery's not going to show up any second. All right, <laughs> roll a perception check. Right. I want to roll a perception check as well to see if I see anything. Me too. Oh, Eighteen, and I don't even remember how to play this game. Guys. I'm I staying add numbers close to, that. to Ripley. Aww, <laughs> it's I got okay. a twenty-one. We haven't seen so. each other in real long. I go to fourteen. Um. We haven't seen each other in, like, an hour, but in in the three to six months that it took us to get through that (laughs) hour, it feels real long. I got a 13. All right. On your way to the fortune stage, you see nothing of interest. (laughs) Okay. Including (laughs) Ripley, who got a 21. She rolled a 21. Oh. But when you get to the fortune stage, sitting on the stage is a large wooden box and standing over the box is Avery. I hate him! Oh I knew this knew was happening. I don't want oh, yeah. it. Vlad, How many people are around? It's just you guys. And Vlad, I was about to shoot this Vlad child. is not around. in sight. Vlad is not in sight. Okay. And so it's, and just, it's just you guys. Us. Yeah. Fuck like he's here. And Avery looks up and is like what the fuck are you people doing here? <laughs> oh. Um... It just felt like going for a midnight stroll. I don't know. And a lucky. I had to get my sheep a walk. But yeah, it's like we midnight. Up. Yeah. yeah we know. And you go. guys left to hide from Vlad, who's going to be back here any second. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I think we left Chip at the barn, though. Insomnia. <laughs> I don't know. You know. I mean, that's good. Chip's in the barn. So you just thought, you guys are just wandering around. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Well, I, <laughs> I mean, if he comes back, we'll just say we haven't found him, which is, you know. What? True. What are you doing here? What do you think you're doing? Well, I'm pretending to look for your friend. Yeah. What's so we're right. The and there's a box here, and I was what's looking at it. Box, I don't know what's in the box. Open the box. You <laughs> open the box. Ma- Mara, <laughs> can I roll the rock, paper, scissors? Sure, I guess. just literally rock, paper, scissors. Yeah, let's just rock, paper, paper, scissors, Sarah. I I thought you were going to just, like, pull up your bow and be like, open the box, motherfucker. (laughs) All right. Open the box, motherfucker. No, 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 it's two out of three. What? No, I won. Okay. Okay, but it it is two out of three. That's how rock, paper, scissors works. Ah. Okay. All right. Okay, so we... we, Okay. (laughs) Yeah! For those Sarah listening, open the box, happened, motherfucker. Uh, Mara just won the rock. That paper was scissors. nothing. That was rock paper scissors. Why does that mean I have to open the box? You lost. <laughs> so the rules. You open the That's box. The rules of rock paper scissors. Open That's the not box. the rules. That no, the I don't want to open the open box. Open the box, or I'll shoot you. I don't you. know what's in the box. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what if it's a tarantula? No, we no, don't. No. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I don't no. want to open it. Do we hear any noises coming from the box? Uh, roll an investigation <laughs> check for the box. Um, 18. 10, the god. I'm not doing the Dora, are you today. doing anything? I don't know. I'm, I'm She's looking dying at of it. a migraine. I don't think I are have t- a very good investigation, so... No, I All right, don't. so what did you get? 7, 18. no, 10. 10, 10 18. Plus. Ripley, you hear a whirring 
from the box. A whirring. Like a... Like Ingrid's yeah, laptop. It's the gremlin. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, um, all right. That doesn't sound like we should open it, but... <laughs> What if we just, like, open it a little bit and look at it and then close it? (laughs) (laughs) What if we open a little bit? What if we just kill him a little bit? (laughs) (laughs) What if we just don't open it, actually? Because it's none of our business. Well. All right, you said Vlad's on his way here. Have you ever seen Vlad's handwriting? (laughs) No. All right. Just can Vlad Vlad read? (laughs) Vlad, I mean... Probably not. Avery, can you write or read? Yeah. Okay, that's good. This isn't your handwriting, right? No, don't show the note, Mara! (laughs) Okay, don't do it. (laughs) No, I just... He's far enough away he can't actually read it. I just, like, hold up the note and then I put it back. (laughs) No, that's not my handwriting. What did that say? (laughs) It said, um... It said Avery It's a nice (laughs) sacrifice. It's it said what? Avery sucks. <laughs> it sounds like you have a problem with me. Yeah, I do. Hell yeah. So I, don't say, I don't say hell yeah. Ripley doesn't say hell yeah. Do you want to go? Y'all, y'all, y'all. You're 13. I don't really. Yeah. Y'all. Shh. I'm 13. I don't so really want to talk to Vlad right now, so can we figure out what's happening? Please. So are we gonna open up the box or not? You're Dora, closer. So I'm not goes open forward this box? and opens the box. <laughs> what if we say that we decided it would be best if Chip just left town? Can, yeah, so sure. he has a head start That's to fine. get away from Vlad. Can I okay, roll Chip's to gone open now. The box, please. Uh, the roll a dexterity <laughs> check, I guess. Okay, why is it dexterity? <laughs> What kind of box is Because this? you're opening the box, but then you need to roll a dexter- dexterity saving uh, throw. Oh, saving throw. How about that? Okay. Yeah. Um, so it's eight You don't need to roll four. to open a box. <laughs> what was it? It's a really hard to open box. How big is this box? How do you do, how do, you do saving throws? Is it just d20 plus your thing? Plus your saving throw. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, which, so yeah. that's that, uh, 13. Okay, a 13. Um, the box is like, um, Is it bigger than a bread box? <laughs> yes. It's like, it's pro- it's, I guess it's probably, it's a square and it's probably like half Avery's height. Okay. Wow, that's a big box. Yeah, it's a big box. There's a bomb in the box, isn't there, Shannon? <laughs> so you open the box. Uh-huh. There's a bomb in the box. Out of How the box. are you guys? Out the box. It's out of the box. <laughs> Are you guys... Okay, so Dora is now on the stage to open the box. Are you guys on the stage? No. no. You guys are, like, in, in the, the audience. audience. We're, like, okay. three rows back, I think. I'm we so got from the away, being like, be careful. I'm, like, three rows back. Where is Lucky? I've just uh, been he's walk- with you. Okay, I've that's just cute. been walking forward, like, while you guys have been arguing and going, you have the just- box, well, you need to do it. I, you, I think you don't like me. No, I don't like you. You're 13. <laughs> And then you just open the box. Yeah. Um, out of the box uh-huh. comes the box. a uh-huh. box-shaped thing. Another box. Another box. It is a, a square thing with two eyes and legs and arms and wings. It's called it's a, a robot. Um, it's called a modron. But a modron. <laughs> yes. Silly. It's very uh, like it's like a it's like a robot. It's very like steampunky. Okay. Um, <laughs> But all I want, all I want is for me to look at this and just be like, like pitching me. Is that a new kind of sheep? <laughs> is this a sheep? <laughs> I don't think she would do that though. She knows a lot about sheep. She knows they don't look like whirring robot monsters. Oh my god! Um, it has like <clears throat> slung over its back. Well, not really slung over its back. It's a box. <laughs> but attached to his back is a short bow and a quiver of arrows. What the and hell? Okay. Hand. It's a robot with a bow and arrow. It's a flying <laughs> a robot monster. A steampunk bow and arrow. <laughs> and in its hand... This feels like a Roomba with a knife Is this... <laughs> Roomba, Roomba. Can we name it Roomba? Can it be called a Roomba instead of a Modron? <laughs> sure. Um, in its hand is this, like, rod... 
um, with I, like. I mean, spell this for me. I need a picture. Okay, M O D R O N, and it's specifically a quadrone. Q U A D R O N E. Right. What the oh fuck? my what? god! Why does it look like that? What it's are those? Girl. Look at this one where it's like an old man. <laughs> what? I love it. Look it's at amazing. It. It's so cute. Yes. It's the cutest thing I've ever seen. It's I very want cute. It. Um, so it lifts out of the box and is flying in the air with its metal wings. It's so cute. Um, I so fight it. it has this rod. The rod is not in the picture. The rod. Yeah, is I definitely don't else. want to fight this thing. It's adorable. The rod and the rod is like. Uh, uh, probably like half its height. Uh, it's not a super long rod, is basically what I'm saying, and it's got like a flanged head. Um, and it uh, goes up. It like floats for a second uh-huh. and looks at you guys. <laughs> I'm really excited now. This thing's You're like, adorable. oh my goodness. I'm like, oh. And then. Um, it like lands on its feet. Uh, when it's standing, it's about Avery's height. Okay. And it grabs Avery by the ankle and <laughs> flips him up. Yes. And oh he's like, <laughs> screams. I'm so excited. Mara. And a bunch of gold falls out of his pockets. Mara, nice. And um, <laughs> it floats up in the air, so then like Avery is dangling. And it like points the rod at him, and the rod glows for a second. And the uh, Modron says, you have been weighed. You have been measured. (laughs) You have been found wanting. And then it (laughs) flings Avery through the air and he flies over your head. I love this thing. Screaming and he slams into a tree and then falls on the ground. Mara is like beautiful and simultaneously being like I didn't get to do that <laughs> well I yeah that was amazing <laughs> so you guys are just looking up in awe We're just, I, I, I feel like, like I'm grinning and, okay and so um, I think Lucky looks a little bit horrified though He's no like, we're excited um, and then Lamodron turns and looks at you guys and it says he wants the red head and it starts floating towards you. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> so roll for initiative. Oh, I don't know. Oh, what is this thing? Jesus. It just did the best thing I've ever seen. What did it say? It came out and looked... It, it, it's, ca- it just said he wants the red head. Um, oh. Oh, no. <laughs> I got he a seven. He wants the red head. I get it. I, I get know. It. I just like eight. saying it. It's fun. This is a good voice. I like it. Seven. Um, um, yeah, I got an eight. I enjoy this red head. Okay, this this box robot and this voice. I love the me. box. The I'm box so is amazing. D- I don't want to fight the box. <laughs> What'd you get? A one. <laughs> <laughs> Plus your dexterity or your initiative, whatever. Dexterity. I mean, it's the same number. Plus three. <laughs> Okay, three total. Um, so what did Ripley get? Seven. Yeah. What did Mara get? Mara got eight. Eight. Uh, I got a roll get? for Lucky and Marty. <laughs> so Marty. let me open up Marty. their character sheets. I love Marty. Oh my god, we're rolling initiative. This is the best day of my life. And it's so exciting. <laughs> um, so how's it, guys? How's it going, guys? Um... It's going all right. I'm trying to um, reconcile the fact that this adorable robot just came out, did the best thing I've ever seen, and now we have to fight it. Marty rolled a 23. Marty rolled a 3? A 23. Oh. Very different. Good. Which is good, because the quadrone rolled a 20, so. Where's my lucky character sheet? My lucky character sheet. My lucky character sheet. Okay, here we go. Let's see what Lucky rolled. Not as good. His name is Lucky. It's very cute. It is cute. Okay. Um. Seven. So the order is Marty, the Modron, Mara, 
Ripley, Lucky, Dora. I'm finally not hey. at the beginning. I'm so happy. All right. Hey, let me remember what spells I have. Oh, I've used up all my spells slots, y'all. I'm really y'all. sad that I only rolled a three. Just take them back. <laughs> take them back. Cool. Because you guys have been resting. Well, Because cool. my... What I was going to do is just slam it on the head. Well, you bah. can still possibly do that. It's flying, though. With its little I'm metal tall. wings. I just love I the image. Jump. Okay, um... Marty, uh... I guess Marty is, like, right next to you guys. Dora is on the stage. Um, but it's flying mm-hmm. towards Ripley and Mara and Lucky. And Marty is going to uh, pull out his hand crossbow. Um, and he is going to okay. shoot Don't hurt it. the quadron, quadron um, in the face. How do you roll? Okay. I know, I know what I'm going to do. He rolled. A 17, which hits, so he does five damage. Ooh, Uh, that's my boy. That's my beautiful (laughs) boy. My beautiful magic boy. All right, and now it is the Quadron's turn. Um... Okay, so the quadrone uh, is going to draw its short bow. It's okay, dog. It's just the Jehovah Witnesses. <laughs> it is. I'm telling um, Sunny that Jehovah's Witnesses. The quadrone like puts the rod into a like loop on its side, and it pulls its short bow out. And since Marty shot it, it's gonna shot at Mar- shoot at Marty. No. Um. It rolled bad, um, so <laughs> it um, misses. It the arrow just kind of like flies right by Marty, and embeds itself in one of the benches. All right. And now it is Mara's turn. It oh, is. What are you gonna do? Floating. Uh, How far away is it? Um, maybe like. Ten feet away. Not very far. Probably best thing would be to shoot it with my bow. Yeah. And you can always, like... Wait, how do we do this again? What's the... <laughs> you roll a d20. Okay, and then what do I add? And then you add your attack bonus. Right, okay. for We don't remember how to play this game. Nine. I rolled bad. Plus. No, she That's got a nine. three plus. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, that does not hit. So Lucky is ashamed of me. <laughs> Lucky is ashamed of me. <laughs> Lucky just I'm looks at you and shakes Mara is actually head. good at archery, guys. <laughs> so, although you did hit Richard Quinn on the balcony, you did. That was very good. So you shoot, and it. I think it just like. I think you like overshoot, and it just flies over it. Mara is or it, like moves well. down. It hits it just, the stage. <laughs> it just. I'm, it hits the stage. That was behind a little you. theater joke for you yeah. guys. <laughs> um, okay, now it's Ripley's turn. No. Um, I don't even remember what my spells are, guys. <laughs> I'm trying to think of something that I can do that... Because I don't think she would fight this thing. Um, you could, like, mess up its wiring with water. I was just thing. thinking that. Yep, yep. I'm going back to my, my default, y'all. I'm going to dump some water on it. Cool. <laughs> um... <laughs> Um, so how do I cast a spell? Does. I don't remember how to do that. I'm pretty sure you just cast it. Okay. Uh, let me double check. What's the spell called? Create, destroy water. Let's look it up real quick. Yep, I am. Um, I only have one. I have two moves. I have. I throw can do water one on thing. It, and I have throw a flame at it, which hasn't really worked out for me ever. So I'm just gonna throw water on it. Yeah, so it's just gonna rain on. Um, okay. Um, and, and probably us because we're also in thirty feet. Count as a as a small flame. <laughs> Extinguishing. Well, flame. you don't see a flame on it, so um, I'm trying to decide how to determine like how this affects it. Um, 
It's gonna affect it because it's a robot. Yeah, it's but like, rough. there's not a like die to roll damage for water. Yeah, I know. Um, I don't even. Re- I don't even really want to damage it. I just want to throw it off its throw it off its um, rhythm. <laughs> Ripley, street smarts, Harry Potter, <laughs> street smarts. <laughs> that would be Ripley, street smarts. <laughs> um, okay, so go get it. <laughs> I'm street gonna smart. say like you don't necessarily <laughs> damage it, but it like. Um, I wasn't trying to damage it's, it. It's yeah. It's gonna like have disadvantage. It kind of like jitters a little bit. I threw as it off its rhythm. Hits. Yeah, um, and so and then it keeps flying, but it's a little bit like uh, jerking around. Mm-hmm. Um, so it'll have disadvantage. Um, it is Lucky's turn, unless you want to move or anything. You guys are all staying in one place. Um, yep. Okay. So Lucky is also going to pull out a bow because... That's what they do. That's what we got. Um, his short bow, I guess. Uh, he rolls really badly. (laughs) No, not He rolled a five. He's just so nervous. Oh, babe. Um, He's like, I just went on a date, and now I'm in a fight, and I don't know what happened. He, like, because it's, like, jerking around a little bit, he has a little bit of trouble aiming, and as he shoots, that's it, like, drops a foot in the air, and it flies over, and it also hits the stage. And now it's Dora's turn. It's my turn. Yeah, so you're, I guess because you're on the stage... And it's like sunk. It's like flying, but it sunk a little bit lower. I have to get hit by water. It sunk then a little bit. It's it's more. It's on your level. I have a, I have a new idea. Okay. A better idea, you might say. Okay. An amazing idea. Adora you might idea. Say. Adora, Adora idea. TM. So I am on the stage. Yeah. I get ready for myself. I'm gonna run and take a running jump. To try and jump on top of it. Yeah! <laughs> yeah. Um, it's a great idea. I guess roll... roll athletics? Um, do you think that's athletics or acrobatics? Um, I um, think it's acla- I think athletics. It's athletics. Yeah, it's Sounds athletics. Like flipping over stuff. Yeah. Okay, so roll for athletics. Okay. So you're trying... 18 plus 7. Okay. 19, 20, so, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. <laughs> okay, so you do this really well. Um, are you trying to, like, bring it to the ground and, like, be on top of it? No, I'm just trying She's to She's going be for that Mara move. I'm just trying to... I'm trying to jump and be on top of it. And While it's flying. this will end up with Dora just, like, sitting on top of this thing and, like, it... I'm, like... Can it hold you know, your weight, it. Dora? Let's ha- roll a strength yeah, exactly. check That's... for the quad drone. Or a strength saving throw. This thing is real um, not that big, and you're a giant no. lady. Um, yeah, I, I think uh, you jump on it, and you bring it to the ground. But, like, okay, cool. you don't, like, crush it. It's just kind of, you're just yeah. kind of, like, on it. <laughs> and this box is just, like, sitting cool. on the ground. Will we ever have a fight where someone is does not get pinned to the arms? ground? Yeah, it's like... <laughs> um, <laughs> it's got, like, its bow and arrow. <laughs> it's just like... <laughs> okay, and now um, it's Marty's turn. So... <laughs> but you're on top of it, so, like... Yeah. Have I not subdued it? I mean... Can that be the end of the fight now? Um, She's on top of it. I mean, I guess it could, but, like, I'm gonna then go okay. to the Modron to see if it's gonna be able to, like, fight you off in some way. Right. 
Um, yeah, I've, I've used my move. I've got nothing else. So it's gonna, um... I think it's just gonna, like, grab the rod and try to hit you. <laughs> like, reach Do over and be like... like dodge Dirk. it? Uh, no, I think... Like, I, what is this? A I, dexterity? No, it's just gonna roll an attack roll. Um, okay. Well, it rolled a six. Does that hit you? <laughs> I don't know. My armor class is 13. So does then it, it doesn't. Me? I don't No. It's just like flailing just like, around <laughs> underneath you. I want to know what Marty is thinking in this moment. <laughs> Good. <laughs> what Marty's thinking? No, because he's been on the receiving end. Not from Dora. Well, yeah. But <laughs> he's like, how does it feel? <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, then I guess you have successfully subdued the Mojan Quadra. Good job, Dora. And it's just flailing okay, underneath I'm just you. Gonna, I'm just keeping sitting on it. Okay, um, it's just it just keeps repeating, like, he wants the redhead, he wants the redhead. Terrifying. Um, do I have a way of, like, is there something in the back of its head, like a, like a gearbox or anything? Uh, no. I mean, it's all, like, made up of panels. Um, if you okay. want to try to, like, peel I, I it I can't open. take its little robot batteries out or anything, then. Um, I mean, if you want to try to, like, open it Do up in some way, it. you can. You don't see a specific no, place no, that's, like, think... this is where the battery or off switch is. <laughs> like. Right, okay. Well, in that case, I just, I just like, pop it on the head to try and okay, uh, get it to go I mean, to I guess go ahead and roll, um, I mean, roll, like, an attack roll, but with advantage. Okay. What's an attack roll? Send me that, I'll read it later. So, roll a d20 plus your strength, since you're just hitting it on the head. Oh, okay. That's, um, 13 plus 5. So. Okay, so... 18. Yes, so you bop it on the head, now roll for damage. Roll a d4 plus your strength. I that's, got a 1, but that's plus 5, so 6. Okay, so you do 6 damage to it. Um, it's... Were you, are you doing that specifically to try to break it open, or just trying to, like... No, I'm trying to knock it out, kind of Okay, thing. well... That didn't... It's not knocked out. I'm just... It, well, I'm just gonna keep doing that, Shannon. Okay. Well, I guess to save us from rolling over and over again, <laughs> we'll just say you hit it a couple more times until it is knocked out. Is that good? Okay. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah. Do, do, does it do, go? Do. Does it go? He wants the red hole. <laughs> <laughs> and then it just, like... It, it has metal eyelids that shut, and it's, like, oh hands God. dropped to its sides. Yep, all right. Who is okay. he? Well, you could have asked, but it's 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 unconscious Dora now. decided to knock it out. It's yeah, <laughs> I wanted to ask him I support before her he was in her decision. It's, I, love, I love this, oh, Dora. I didn't think... It, I love this door who just barged up, opened the box, jumped on it, bang, bang, bang. And you guys are like, all right. All right. Um, all right. Uh, well, I didn't think it was going to be able to answer that. I mean, it's a little robot, dude. I mean, it was it was together enough to say you've well, been measured, you've been found wanting. Yeah, like, it's good can, that you stopped him, Dora. I'm just... We can, don't. we can bring him back to mm. Catherine's and interrogate him. And has Vlad not showed up yet? Like, should we at check? this moment. <laughs> at this moment. I mean, do you want to check on Avery? No. Um, on at this hand, Avery still on one hand, if he needs medical attention, we should be good people. On the other she's, hand, fuck him. He, yeah, he's he, been trying to literally. He's murder unconscious him this whole time. at like like behind the last row of benches. Oh, then he's fine. Okay. <laughs> Can we, wait, 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 Can we go get, um... No, he doesn't have our money anymore. We were gonna give him a... Wait. The... When the Modron 
shook out shook all his him gold. Out. He shook out all his gold. You froze. Is um, Avery's money? Gold. I don't know. It's someone's yeah. money. Um, can I roll to search Avery's pockets? <laughs> Can we pick up well, all the gold? Pick first? up the gold that fell. Okay. Pick up the um, gold. It's not like a lot of gold uh, that fell. Let's say like you pick up ten gold. Okay. Um, that gives me nineteen gold. We owe Bree a lot of money, but uh, you. Um, <laughs> yeah, we owe Bree like what four hundred or a something. Lot. We owe Bree a lot. I think it's like two hundred. Two hundred. Um. So you go over to Avery unconscious. Good. I gotta open up his items. Um, Dora is uh, Mara's no, secretly a Dora. big softy because she keeps saying like, "Oh, I'm gonna kill him." I'm gonna I mean, kill him, I want to kill she... Marty. I I want not Marty. I want to <laughs> kill Avery. I need him to be brought back so that I can kill him. I mean, you could wake him up and no, kill him. No, I'm not. I'm gonna search his pockets. Okay. Um, you search his pockets. Let's say you find like uh, five more gold that didn't okay. fall out. Um, right, take that gold. You Jesus, find... Jesus, this kid spends money like water. <laughs> <laughs> he does. You find... I, what I was saying is Mara's just gonna take, like, everything. Depends on what all is in his pockets. Um, he really doesn't have that much in his pockets. Uh, he's got a wand. He's got a flute. Another flute? Yeah, just like a regular flute. Not a Not a pan, pan flute. flute. Um, and then he has, um, he has a pouch of, um, dust. I'll take the money in the pouch of dust. Okay, you're gonna leave the flute and He'll, the wand? I'll leave the flute, the flute. you know, extracurricular activities. I mean, <laughs> then the he also take- has all of his jewelry. I will take the flute and Should the I wand. Should I take his jewelry? <laughs> take his jewelry because it's it's secretly it's magically stuck. weapons. That's true. I take his jewelry. <laughs> Let me delete. We're all just this stuff. robbing this child because he, he robbed, robbed us. <laughs> okay. What is um, Lucky dur- doing during this? I think Lucky is like, what are you doing? <laughs> so he stole like four hundred gold from our friend Bree, and he said he in. It's a whole thing. I need to pay Bree back. She's my best friend. Okay, so you're robbing a 13 year old kid? This was a terrible mistake to bring. Yes! Yeah, okay. he's, he's a jerk. He is a jerk. Um, um, I was gonna leave him with his flute and his wand, but someone wants them. Yeah. Um, as you guys I are. Them. I mean. Okay. No, Vlad's gonna come back and see us. As you his guys are robbing body. Avery, I'm Vlad. not. I'm standing on the other side. <laughs> Vlad walks up from like the back stage of the stage, and is like, "Hey, what are you guys doing here?" Oh, oh. hey. Avery needs medical attention. What? <laughs> he got knocked out by a Modron. Yeah, you gotta take him to a healer. <laughs> Wait, Dora, are you Dora? You're not sitting on the Modron anymore, huh? Cause it's just no. dead. Okay. I've I've got the murder on under. Can my you put arm. it back in the box? Put it back in the box. Oh, it's under your arm. Okay. Okay. It's just she's just, just carrying it. I'm robot. just carrying it around. Um, he needs medical I mean, attention. It does not it look like box. you're healing him. I I'm not a healer. I mean, I don't care. I don't like him. No, but exactly. that's fine. You need to take him to a healer. And I like, I'm like trying to pick Avery up. Like, <laughs> While well, also the carrying the Motron <laughs> under one arm. <laughs> yeah. So you pick you pick Avery up. Um, <laughs> I guess roll a dexterity check to see if you can successfully. I don't, okay, I don't throw him. I don't Wait. throw him. I just hold Pause. him out towards Vlad. What? I did I get Avery's jewelry, or did I not have enough time? Um, I think you were in the middle of taking his jewelry. So, okay, so, so like did you like snatch it. it or did you put it back? So he's got a bunch of rings and he's got a bunch of necklaces. What'd you go for first? Necklaces. Okay. So we already know one of them's a sword. So. Did you, like I guess roll a dex check for me to decide how many of these oh, yeah, you fine. got. Man, I'm a terrible date. Jesus. I was just <laughs> Oh no. Can I re-roll because I like ran into your water bottle? I guess so. <laughs> it was worse, so we're fine. I had five. Okay, we'll just say that you, just because you rolled a five, you got the one that you know turns into a sword. Oh, that's cool. Okay. Um, Sword necklace. Yeah. So, (laughs) let me just delete some stuff from Avery's inventory. (laughs) (laughs) 
had it two years. I did. Um, so he no so wait, longer I, has his wand. Well, it's fine that I missed all that, because I'm standing over he with no the sheet. He no longer sheet has his flute. Actually, I'm pretty sure I wait, left the sheet Wait, did Dora have happens. enough time to get over to him to take the wand and the flute? Um, I think so. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Guys, I just want to state, well, I never think said of it, this. Here's, yes. Oh, I did say I was taking the sheet for a walk. Never mind, I was going to say here's I left the what I, but no, here's I Here's how I see it. You're, like, going through his pockets. You pull out, like, the wall and the flute and just kind of toss them to the side, and the door is like, I'll take this. <laughs> um, yeah. <laughs> We're terrible. We're so bad. I'm okay. just with my okay. sheep. So he still has all his jewelry except the one that turns into I think I only took, like, three sheep and the rest of them aren't Catherine's. Um, Sierra Jay's a baby. She needs sleep. Okay, so... uh. You have successfully robbed the child. Uh, Do- so, Dora, you're, like, so picking him up to, like, oh. hand him to I Vlad. I pick him up and I just hold him out to Vlad. Yeah. Okay, and Vlad's like, I don't want this. <laughs> Mate, like, he was your charge. Like, it's your responsibility. I mean, not he really. You, you got yeah. to do a solid back. Uh, I mean, he no, also tried to rob me. We- I don't give a shit. You can rob him back if you want. Here. It looks kind of like there's nothing you left to rob. To I mean, he's still wearing a lot of jewelry. I only got one necklace. <laughs> That's true. I don't say that out loud. Um. <laughs> Vlad's like, can't, can't you Take, just like. No. Can't you just like no. drop him no, off at no, the, no, the police no, station? No. That's what I'm going to do. No. <laughs> Lucky just you like waves. You can do that. You go do that, sir. I, I pipe up. I'm like, go this. ask for Jennifer Lestrade. She's very nice. <laughs> She'll help you out. Um, okay. She's a cop. Just tell her. Good day, sir. Just remind her, <laughs> remind her that she needs to search his pockets first, because we've had issues with that in the past, and I, like, look over at Marty, and I'm just like, uh, <laughs> just... She'll know, she'll be fine. Marty's just like shrug emoji. Oh, I forgot I took that that pouch of dust off of him, so I have yeah. two pouches of dust. Um, it's about the same amount as the one you had before, so enough for like one trip. Um, roll a persuasion check, Dora, to convince. It's charisma, <laughs> so like. This, I'm good at very that. Yeah. <laughs> I'm very charismatic. I rolled a seven there, um, but it's plus six. So. Okay, so he's like, all right, uh, I guess give him to me. He doesn't ask I about I said good Chip, day, sir. Because uh, Chip's not with us. It. I give him to him. You just drop Avery into his arms. Uh, and he's, I guess he's like, have you guys found that um, kid who took my sword? No. no. Uh, I, I think Mara must be right. I think he left town. Yeah. Damn, I'm gonna have to buy a new sword. Sucks. Sorry. No, it does suck. <laughs> well, <laughs> it does suck. <laughs> Thanks for all your help. I guess. Uh, sorry. I don't, I don't know. We were pretty bad at it. And he just like sorry, we weren't better. Help. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you should be sorry. Yeah, he just sorry. like flings Avery over his shoulder. Leaves. And then he leaves. <laughs> all right. Well, I've Good. got. 20 of Bree's 400 gold Aces. that we owe her. Um, I like how we got out of this situation and never fought Vlad. <laughs> like, Vlad was just like, alright, I guess they... never fought Avery either! I, I know, but I guess he's just like, I guess they just tried to, you know, help me find the kid and didn't succeed. Bye! <laughs> no, he clearly thinks we're idiots. Yeah. yeah, I know, but I'm just saying he doesn't think that we're in cahoots with Chip, though. That's good, that's good. We did good, um, guy, dear guy. Alright, you guys have, I guess, defeated Vlad. You have solved my sword Riddle. and boy thief <laughs> riddle. You have sold. You have solved my Vlad puzzle. <laughs> you have solved my Vlad and Avery puzzle. But Marty still has more time in the tournament tomorrow. Yeah, you have a whole day left in this festival, and you also have a robot. What do you do next? What do we do next? And you also him? get one wish. The wish we're saving. I'm not worried um, about that yet. Should I like? put um, the robot in the box and then uh, just carry the box around with the robot in. Yeah, that seems That smart. sounds solid. Okay, so smart. you okay. do that. No issue. 
Um, are you guys just going back to Catherine's? Then? I guess. Yeah, we got to yeah, it. We figured out oh, with the okay. oh, You know what? We're going back to Catherine's, but once we get out of view of, like, a ton of people... I know it's midnight, but whatever. Um, I'm going to get Robin out of the flu. Mm-hmm. Okay. What song do you play? Well, I was going to say... Uh, I'm gonna. I don't know. What At some song. point, Lucky's gotta like go to work. He life. is staying. Yeah. Oh yeah. So no, I think Lucky. You, twice. Lucky's had a very <laughs> okay. Think, good. Good. I good. Think Lucky's like okay. I'm Lara, back. I'm back. I gotta go to sleep. That's understandable. I'm it's, sorry. It's that, been like, fun. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Nice Bye. meeting you. Yeah. Wait. 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 Uh, I go in for a cheek kiss. Does he misinterpret? <laughs> oh my god! Uh, let's. Uh, uh, what should we roll for that? <laughs> roll a um, whatever like you rolled for the high five. High five. <laughs> Lucky will roll an insight check. <laughs> I will roll uh, dexterity. I guess. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to know. Oh, oh, charisma. Know. Okay, roll, 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 roll. <laughs> 19. Okay, so you go in for a cheat because he <laughs> misinterprets because he rolled a natural one. <laughs> Baby! Oh, is it a real one? kiss? What is he misinterpreted as? <laughs> it's a real kiss. Oh, that's nice! Yes, I think that's the I like interpretation. Because he failed to uh, be insightful. Oh! And then you guys kiss. Aww! That's cute! Ripley, like, looks away. <laughs> <laughs> Marty just is like, Ew. <laughs> Ew. You guys have known each other, like, Ew. an hour. <laughs> yeah, it's been, like, a day. Yeah, that happens sometimes. So, so then, you got so it's just, but it's a really, like, it's a really awkward kiss. Yeah. Because he, ro- he rolled a nat one. Yeah. But you rolled a 19, so, like. I'm real really smooth, good. and he is not. Yeah, he doesn't fine. know that you were just going for a cheat kiss. Yeah. You're real smooth in the saving it. And <laughs> he's like, oh ah. I'll see you tomorrow. Yeah, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye. We'll meet up. Uh, yeah. We'll meet up here. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. I'll be here. Yeah. I'm just Have looking at Dora like, can yeah. you believe this? <laughs> Lucky walking away like I can't wait no. to tell Kit about Dora this. Dora is so like distracted by doing actual like quest stuff. <laughs> All right. She's so you guys, like, you guys. Oh, so you fine. you you bring Robin out like on the walk back. Well, the song that I play is Missing You by Twice. Okay. Um, so you, you bring them out yeah. on the walk, right? You guys are walking? Yeah, are you I waiting? bring them out. I'm like, hey, dude. Can I just real quick, before we do that, have you roll a history check? Have my all favorite, of you guys roll okay. a history check? I just want to say while we're rolling this history check that my favorite... I got a 19. My favorite... Um, thing about the fact that we've been playing for a year but it's been like two weeks in world is that all of our new interests over the course of the past year have made it in like the Percy Jackson musical and twice and like random other things so you got you got a 20 20 was it a nat 20 no it was 17 plus 3 okay because Marty rolled a nat 20 Um, and he has a zero history Um, what'd you roll 19 Okay, what'd you roll, Dora? For history. Ten. Okay, so... Ten. Dora does not know what this robot is, but the rest of you guys know that, uh, what a Modron is. Uh-huh. And I guess what a quad- Quadron is, because you rolled really well. They're basically, um, this, uh, species of, um, robot. Um, let me just go ahead and, like, read some of this out to you. Modrons species are... Species of robot. Well, species. Modrons are beings of absolute law that adhere to hive-like hierarchy. Um, They inhabit the plane of Mechanus and tend its eternally revolving gears, their existence a clockwork routine of perfect order. So basically they come from another plane of existence. um, But it's not like, oh, what are they doing here? Like, they they came over a while ago. They've kind of been hanging out for a while, but they're all about law and order. Um, SVU. And Law and Order SVU is their favorite show. <laughs> and the um, Quadrone is one of the, like... So they basically have a hierarchy of monodrones, duodrones, tridones, quadrones, pentadrones, and then the, like, um, D20 the primus, primus is So the, I want to like, say this before drone. I forget. So this is, in my mind, this is going either one of two ways, because you said they're, like, beings of law and order. So A, someone... 
some fantasy cop person is <laughs> after cops. Mara. Legitimately, because Mara is an assassin. Or two, someone has corrupted this Modron and made him think the law and order is getting Mara, but they're actually, like, the bad guys yeah. in the assassin cult. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, seems solid logic. Now, the rod that the uh, Quadrone has is not Modronic, I guess. It is, it is not from the Modron world. Um, you can tell Modron. it's it's not like metal like the robot is. Um, it looks more like a magic wand. Okay. It's a rod. It's a little bit bigger. Um, and you did see it glow. Um, so, yeah. But I don't think you necessarily know what that is. Cool. Um, so, you guys know that. Marty knows that. Dora's just like, it's a robot. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Which sounds about right. So, I'm yeah. like, hey, Robin, we found this Hello? robot dude, and it tried oh, it's to a attack Modron. us. Oh, cool. I don't know what that is, but, like, it tried to attack Mara specifically. Oh. So could you, like, just take it and then, like, interrogate it? We can um, interrogate it when it wakes up. Can you tell us when it wakes up? Uh, I guess so. Is this your wish? Just, no. Or is this just a request? No. It's just like, can you do this a solid request? Man? Yeah, I mean, I, I guess no no magic is required. I've... Um, uh, yeah, I suppose I can do that. Uh, Robin you. just, like, gently takes it and is like, what is this? And then goes into the flute. Blue smoke back into the flute. Now we got this box. We need any <laughs> to store anything. Yeah, great. Write box on your inventory. We'll put it in the wagon. Box. <laughs> box. Motron. Motron box. Um. All right, you guys go back to Catherine's. Uh-huh. And you Box. go to sleep. We go to sleep. All right. All right. It's morning. Marty's gonna fight the people. <laughs> He's probably gonna fight Vlad again. Um. I mean, w- or we could just stop here. What happened to your ending this? No matter what, Shannon. Okay, you're right. You're getting Let's us get out this of this over. arc. We're leaving the sheep All festival. Right, um, is there anything that you guys need to do at the sheep festival, other than finish this no. fight and meet Lucky? Again? No. Let's leave. Okay. Well, you need to possibly pay Bree. Okay. Yeah. Trying to decide how I should roll this. Should I just, like, straight up roll a d20, and if it's, like, higher than 10, Marty wins the tournament, and if it's lower than 10? Sure. I'll do, I'll do oh. a d20 plus Marty's attack bonus with a sword. If it's above 15, he wins the whole tournament. Good. We need a paper. Yet. If it's above 10, if it's, like, 10 to 14, then he's, like, second place. He rolled a 10. So Marty gets second place. How much did I say you win for first place? I don't like remember. Five thousand. Is it five thousand gold? I yeah, it was a lot. Yeah. Uh, let's say he wins a thousand gold for second place. Well, it was like yeah. yeah. Or was it a thousand for first place? I don't remember. I have this written down. Give me a second. <laughs> this was like six months ago. <laughs> We've been at the sheep festival for eight months. <laughs> I mean, two days, but out of world, eight months. Jesus. Uh, apparently, I didn't write it down. I hate myself. So just decide. Um, okay, yeah. Just I think- say maybe it's enough to pay off Bree. Okay, so it's enough to pay off Bree. Um, I just remember that I had five hundred gold, and it was like, "Oh, we'll pay five hundred gold to enter the tournament, but you're gonna get it all back. You're gonna win like two thousand or yeah. something." Yeah, I think it was like a thousand or two thousand. I'm gonna say you pay off Bree, and then you have like, let's just say you have like five hundred gold left. Okay, and it's mine. If yeah, sure. But I mean, Marty should get some. Should we split it? Yeah. Okay, Marty and I split the gold. Okay, so two fifty each. So let me write down. I mean, um, we're not going to pay Avery, because the whole thing was if Marty won. Yeah, well, Avery is apparently in jail. (laughs) Yeah. Um, 
I mean, he's gonna get out. We all know he's gonna get out. Lestrade is incompetent, but... We love her. We um, love her anyway. Okay, so that's the end of the festival. Oh, we did it. Um, oh my do you guys want to go shopping? It's the end of the oh, festival to dance before okay. the king. I don't, need to, I don't know. if I, Do I need a shot? Well, just, you know, there was the welcome wagon. Okay. Let's uh, my uh, place. Send us the link again. I don't remember what was on the welcome wagon. Okay. Bree and Sarah. Bree and Mara go shopping. Bree and Sarah. Bree and Sarah. <laughs> so everybody is shopping. Bree is there. Lucky's there. Lucky and Mara hold hands. Yeah, they do. Brie, what oh, is no. Brie's Brie is just like, Brie is like at the level of your yeah. hands and it's just like, we don't have enough for the movie. Looking at them like, guys. ooh. Yeah, no, you don't, I you still like, don't have a lot of money. Um, what? Dora you could buy some and Pokeballs. Ripley, Dora and Ripley are walking around with Marty in the vein of um, Mina and Jonghyun as, um, yes! as Jayun's mums spoiling yeah. her at yes. the back. Yes, Are Marty you has his little, like, hammer, blow yes. up hammer. And he has a backpack now. <laughs> <laughs> yes. You guys just bought him stuff. Yeah. You don't, no, have, don't any have any money. money. You won stuff. You won a backpack. Yeah, we just We didn't have any around, money to enter like, stuff. Well, basically, Marty is, like, running over things and going, Oh, I want that. Oh, I want this. Oh, I want that. And me, me yeah. and Ripley are kind of walking at a leisurely pace nearby. Being and we're like, just no. Telling each other, what does the yeah, ball we're telling each other now? about what's happened in our days. Um, what was that? Sarah? And we're reacting ball of catching to catching you. It's a Pokeball. To everything. So the ball of catching. Hold on, let me bring up my it's like a Pokeball. Yeah, but um, what does it catch? Yeah, I have a specific. Uh, can it catch anything? Can you be like, Richard, mm, Quinn, no. go! <laughs> um, where is it? Modron, go! Ball of catching. It allows you to catch a creature or object of any size within throwing distance. Must succeed in a roll for dexterity. Um, I think you have to get... <laughs> what is the limits on creature? Of ten. That's just anything that's living. Um, I'd wow. like two of those, please. And can it can only hold one object or one creature at a time. She's getting two. Okay, you're getting two. I'd like two, two of those, because I can put people, I can catch people with them. Yes, you can. Okay, I want two of them. Yeah, okay, so that is 50 gold. 50 gold, please! I give you oh, it's the popcorn seller! I get it. I love you, kids. I've been seeing you around. <laughs> You're so much fun. Thank you for coming back to my wagon. The welcome wagon. That's a nice wagon. No one's going to understand that reference. That's a very nuanced reference to my <laughs> high school friends. All right, so you have two balls of catching. Cool. Um, I make a joke about catching Lucky with the ball of catching. I can't think of an actual joke, so I'm just saying that I made it. And it was do you just, funny. like, pretend to throw it at him? Yeah, that'd be cute. I think he kind of is like, oh, what? Oh, oh, oh it's a joke. Oh, it's, a joke. <laughs> it's a joke, you, you sweet boy. Such a um, with, okay. uh, I don't think Bree buys anything. Bree's pretty good. Uh, I mean, Marty has 250 gold now. Is he going to buy anything? I gotta tell you guys something. Marty has had gold this whole time and was just lying to you guys. <laughs> wow, bitch! Douchebag. He had 15 gold. He used it to buy his turkey legs. Um, <laughs> that's fine. That's fine. Oh, 15 is one thing. No, yeah. No, that's fine. That's chill. I figured that was chill. I mean, you you guys probably still don't know in fiction, but he did just keep showing up with food and he did and we not question like, it. Okay. No, we probably figured that he had money or he was... He was um, stealing it. Yeah. So. Ooh, does Marty want to buy any of this with his 250 gold? Watch Shannon flip through this list. Nah. Nah, because all the cool stuff is too expensive. I mean, if he wants to buy, like, Moon Puncher or something, I could lend him the money. The extra gold. Um, I mean, I don't think he wants the Moon Puncher. <laughs> I don't think that's something he wants, and he wouldn't want the looking glass. I mean, I mean would he, wouldn't he? Mantis. I just then want he could to look at himself in to his exist. shades. Um, Ripley wants the moon puncher. No, Ripley doesn't even want the moon puncher. I, Nicole, Nicole wants the, want the moon, moon puncher. puncher. We're gonna punch the moon. Yeah, we're gonna um, punch the moon. I invented the save point for you, Nicole. But it's 5,000 gold. You're never gonna oh, get it. Oh, well. It, it's a save point. Like yeah. in a video game. So. Yeah. That's so cool. Yeah, it's a spear. It's very cool. It's a spear. So yeah. Are we guessing? Are we guessing that the um, 
the welcome wagon will just travel around and be around near us, usually. I'm sure I'll see you kids again. Right. I like to Very travel. Nice. Very <laughs> If good. you guys ever go to Crossroads City, I'm sure you'll see me there. Okay. What is this <laughs> wagon seller's name? I feel like we have a Garfield okay, now yeah, and come I up, need a name. Come up with a name. Um... I um, think it should wait, be tell me what cabbage. they tell me what they look like. Tell me what they look like. Uh well it's this old woman. Um, I think she should be called cabbages. Okay. She's got like <laughs> I'm gonna tell you what she looks like. She's got very like dark hair. I think it's kinda very dark red. Like in the sunlight you're like, Oh that's red. Okay. Um, but otherwise it kinda looks brown. Um she's got dark skin. And she's kind of, like, short and hunched over. I'm down with naming her Cabbages. Okay, Cabbages. I Let cabbages me find my Cabbages. Name. Just remember, time. guys, my name is Cabbages. If you ever... No, can it be Mrs. Look, cabbages? My name is Mrs. Cabbage. <laughs> and if you ever need to find me... No, Mrs. Cabbages. <laughs> Mrs. Cabbages, if you ever need to find me, just say... Do you know where Mrs. Cabbage is? It's with her wealth <laughs> I like that she's just talking to Mara and Bree at this point. So Mara's not going to pass on any of this information. <laughs> Mrs. Cabbage is always there to help. <laughs> with my magical <laughs> menagerie. I love Mrs. Cabbage. Well, she could have... I'm sure that Mrs. Cabbage said the same spiel when we went over with Marty and he just looked at everything. Yeah, probably. And went, I don't want anything. <laughs> <laughs> you, she, you guys didn't buy anything, but she was still like, just remember. <laughs> well, Mrs. Ever, Cabbages. If you kids Marty, ever make some more money, listen, I'll be happy. Marty didn't buy anything, but you best believe that he like asked to look at everything. Like, yeah, he and he was like, he was like, costs. can you hold that? And she was like, no, <laughs> I cannot. <laughs> and he was like, but like. Can you hold it? <laughs> she was Can like, you hold it? But no, no, I can't. no, because there are people with much more money than you <laughs> who will want to buy it. All right. We did it. So I mean the festival. I guess the festival is over. What do you guys Woo. do next? Where are we going to go? We had a nice little montage and everything. It was cute. Um, yeah, you guys. I don't know. What are we gonna do next? Robot. I'm gonna. I'm so happy. I guess. Are we just like hanging out in Fairgate until Robin knows where another thing is? Yeah. Well, shall we? Shall we call Robin out and be like, "Hey, do you know where another thing is?" Yeah, do it. Yep. This will be Maybe a nice I'm setup. Missing you. Missing you. <laughs> okay. Let me decide what the next thing is gonna be. All right, Robin appears. Hey, dude. Um, so, hello. Listen. Yes. Um, do you think it's likely? I mean, do you know where anything is, or alternatively, Let do you think it's it's likely that that it will be in this town or some other town or where? where? I have been searching with my mind's eye. Come I on, boy. I do not detect anything else here in Fairgate, um, but I do detect something in Crossroads City. Oh, where Mrs. Cabbages is going. <laughs> what a coincidence. All right, guys, um, let's get that wagon loaded up. I, I believe that this object is something that we collected before. It can be very dangerous. Um, there... You guys remember how I said there's, like, a chaos spirit ca uh, possessing the cave? Vaguely. It was, yeah. like, eight months there's ago. There's something similar possessing this object. It's a spinning wheel. Um, oh, and fuck. <laughs> Wait, what is it? What Sorry. is it? Oh, a spinning I mean, wheel. Oh, okay, okay, okay. A spinning okay. wheel, you doof. I was thinking of a spinning top. <laughs> so, no. uh, just like... I got this. I'm, I'm on board now. Sleeping. Don't touch it, basically. If I... I'm trying to find it more specifically within the city. 
Guys, there's gonna be a dragon! Um, <laughs> so, if you guys want to start making your way there, hopefully by the time you're at the city, I'll know where to get the spinning wheel. Okay. All right. All right. There's going to be a dragon. Choice. Sound. Uh, all right. Let, we'll get some Let's put all our, all our stuff There's in one the more box. thing we have to do. We have to interrogate the We have to say goodbye. We have to say goodbye, oh, to, lucky. To, say goodbye to Lucky. I don't know what to say. So, um, I mean, Lucky's going traveling, too. That's true. We're partying. So, away. okay, so I, I have, here's what I'm picturing. You guys, like Dora and Marty and Ripley, are packing up the wagon. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and we're loading outside we have this box now, so we can and put stuff in <laughs> it. You guys are like, we can put stuff in this box. <laughs> Marty's like, I can put my gold in the box. Wait, wait, let's ask Robin if he has found out anything from the Modron while they've been chilling. The Modron has not awoken. Okay. okay. Um, but Modrons are quite simple beings. I don't know what... We could get from it, but all right. Well, just I, keep I it. can That's attempt why he was to looking for me. Wake it up. They just need to keep an see. eye on the Modron for us. Yeah, I will keep an eye on it. All right, cool. Thank um, you. So we're packing up the wagon. Okay, and so um, do you go find? Lucky? Is Marty like? Yeah, I guess I'll come with you guys again. Like, I don't uh, have anything better to yeah, do. Yeah, yeah. Marty's like, like, or like Lucky, Lucky and Kit come to us. Yeah, what was Lucky that? and Kit come to you, like, like, because it's like the freaking like, oh, we're moving, like packing up everything and yeah. then they come by and they're like hey yeah Lucky and Kit come but they have their like traveling packs they don't have a wagon they just like walk from place to place um I always imagine Kit like texting but obviously she's not texting but like she's <laughs> fantasy texting she's just, yeah. what is fantasy she's texting just, she just has a scroll out at all times yeah. and she's always writing she's got a little diary and she's just always writing in it <laughs> she's like playing in case some she needs game. something sensational to yeah. read on the train <laughs> Um, so, I, yeah, I mean, we're we gonna go yeah, south. We gotta go. Where are you going? Um, we're going to, okay. Crossroads City. Crossroads City, that's, okay. that's where we're going. Yeah, we've got, like, this, like, Mara's like, we're going to Crossroads City. I know, yeah, Ripley from the side of the wagon is like, Crossroads City! Thanks! Okay, um, so, yeah. what do you got? Going we've on got, there. Yeah, I've got like this quest thing. We're looking oh, for a, okay. a spinning right. wheel. It's not a top. <laughs> like some of us thought. Right. It's like <laughs> one of the spinning wheels. <laughs> yeah, it's cursed or something, so we're gonna go oh, get okay. that and, and fix it. Sounds dangerous. <laughs> yeah. Be fine. Fix it. Um, um, but yeah, I'll write you letters okay. if you'd like. Uh I don't really know how they're gonna get to me. I've um, got some good algae. contacts. <laughs> okay. My pirate um, friends. They're good about getting letters to me. Well, uh, I think I'm going to be in, like, Wolfwater for a while. Okay. So I guess if you just send them there. Yeah. Um, and then if you ever, like, yeah. are down at Wolfwater, like, soon. Yeah. You can say hi. Of course. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's good. Okay. Can we kiss again? Is that weird? <laughs> I don't think you have to roll to kiss again. <laughs> I'm going to my ties anyway. <laughs> She just uh, said that out yeah, loud. I mean, can we kiss again? It, do you say, again? can we kiss again? Sure. Okay, then he's like, yeah. Yeah. All right, you guys kiss. That's great. This is great. Why are you booping my... That's the kiss. Oh, that's weird. <laughs> Don't ever do that again. <laughs> that was really weird. <laughs> Don't ever. Listen, her Shannon, like, leaned over across the table, I and I thought they were going to boop my nose, but it said they, like, touched my mouth, and yep. I didn't enjoy it. I'm it sorry. was weird. <laughs> Um, I mean, it would have been weirder if I had kissed you. Yeah, Don't do that. Do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Uh, okay, so Lucky, like, waves and walks Aww. away. And then keeps Aww. turning around and waving. Baby, I'm missing you. And Kit, I don't know why that's the Kit's just talking like, this episode. Can you hurry up? Kit will understand when yeah. Kit meets Baby, her girlfriend. You. Narnia, Narnia Chavez. Um, all right. I guess that's the end of that, you guys are on your way to Crossroads City. Yeah. Amazing. We did it. Dear Lauren, <laughs> Lauren I, we, a Modron came to attack me. Dora broke him before we could learn who sent him. So that's a thing that's well, happening. I kissed Lucky welcome. two times. Um, it was nice. He is very nice. I'll have to introduce you next time we're all in the same area, which will never happen while I'm on this vengeance quest. We're going to Crossroads City. 
You won't be there. This makes me sad. I miss you a lot. You're great. Baby, I'm Artistic missing Artistic portrayal. Wait, of don't forget the don't forget the last part, which is I don't regret my vengeance quest, but I regret leaving you. Kisses, Mara. Kisses, Mara. And there's like an artistic depiction at the bottom of the Mojan. All of them the, fighting Mojan. I love that Mara now with labels, sends the names drawing. labels. Do you have like a, an unconscious Avery with like X's over his eyes? <laughs> yes. <laughs> it's all stick figures. I don't think Mara can draw very well. <laughs> she draws like freaking um, what's that comic? The one that the D and D comic that I'm. I can't remember what it is. I, know you're of the I don't know. Can I have? This isn't for anything bad. Can I just, for foreshadowing, have you guys roll a perception check as you are wheeling out of town? Okay. I really should know my perception modifier by now. Without having to check. I got a twenty-one. I got a fourteen. Got Dora. A 10. Okay, so just... Well, let me see what Marty got. Marty got bad. Uh, (laughs) So just Mara, I guess as you're, like, leaving the town proper, you see these, like, three figures all in black, and they all have, like, black umbrellas. Um, And they're very pale. Are they demon triplet math teachers? (laughs) They're demon. No, they're they're very like they're elves. They're very like young and pretty, and um, but they're all dressed the same. They're all just very similar. Hold on. Okay, not um, exactly. I think the same I now. think I said they're pale, but actually they have dark skin. I'm trying to figure out just how freaked it. out Mara is by this. Um, I they're very freaky. Um, okay. Are they Marty's family? I'm gonna roll for how freaked out Mara is. Sure. Okay. What would that? Oh, what would that be? Would that they're be survival? Just, um, no. That okay. would not be survival. Let me look. Uh, Wouldn't Shannon roll an intimidation? Yeah, or, I mean, you can roll, like, uh... Intimidation for, saving throw. <laughs> roll for mental health issues. Roll, I guess, a wisdom saving throw? Okay. Um. Yeah, acrobatic, I mean, section, history, insight. Insight? Or intimidation? No. There's, it's two women and a man. Okay. I had to double check. I'll, I'll roll wisdom. There. I rolled a 17. Okay, so I guess you're not that freaked out. Okay. But they are just, like, watching you guys. Okay, go. I feel like she was, like, and initially freaked out because she, like, that yeah. sameness thing. But then she, like, gets a better look and she says, like, they're not dressed exactly the same. They're yeah, dressed no. similarly and they're not all the same gender. So she's, like, she's not, she's not, like, triggered by them and I mean yeah. I don't mean that you know you know I mean that like legitimately yeah it, she's um so yeah so you like kind of make eye contact with them and you look like that like uh okay as the wagon like goes by and the and two of them the man and one of the women um just kind of like turn away but the younger one like keeps watching All right, as then. you guys go off into the woods Somewhere and in New Jersey. <laughs> that's the end of the episode. All right, we did Yay, it, kids. Thank you for listening. The next time will not be three months from now. No. I'm going to put promise. that on the record. That is absolutely true. I will not allow three more months to pass without this happening again. Um, thanks for listening. I'm going to stop recording. Bye. 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 Bye.